Hey guys, Saki here from Saki Tech, and in today's video, I want to talk about the Animoji enhancements on iOS 12 for the iPhone 10. So if you have an iPhone 10, you know about the Animojis. There are these little things over here that can uh, see your face and duplicate your face and do all kinds of weird things. And a lot of people enjoy these, so I want to make a video and show you what is new with Animoji on iOS 12 for the iPhone 10, as well as a brand new feature known as Memoji which is gonna allow you to custom create your own an emoji. So let me go into this message over here. First and foremost, I'm gonna show you four new faces that they have added uh, on iOS 12 for you guys to enjoy. So if you tap the an emoji icon and if you uh, make this big screen, uh, full screen, you'll see at the bottom here, uh, we have this guy over here, this ghost-like creature. Uh, we have the dinosaur, the T-Rex, we have the koala, and we have this other guy right over here. So those are some of the new faces that they added that you can also use to create uh, your own emojis to send to your friends. Now one more thing they've done with the existing emojis uh, is the fact that they added tongue detection into the emoji. So in the past, if you showed your tongue to the camera, it would not do anything. Uh, now when you uh, pull your tongue out of your mouth, it's going to actually register with the emoji and you will be able to create things just like the one I'm doing over here. Uh, with my tongue sticking out. So again, that's gonna apply to all these uh, new and emojis and all the old ones as well. All right, so that's the tongue detection feature that they've added uh, as well. But on top of that, what they've done is they've given you the option to create your own an emoji, which is known as Memoji. So if I scroll down a little bit, you'll see a plus sign over here that allows you to create a brand new face. So let's, uh, let, let's do a walkthrough uh, for this one and see how this looks. So if I click, if I click plus over here, uh, you'll see you get a blank face. Uh, with the face over here, you can pick a skin color or whatever you want, which, whichever skin color you want. You can also tone it uh, down or make it bolder. And then you can also pick, if you want, freckles on the face or not. And as you make these upgrades, you'll see real-time changes happening on the face right here. As a matter of fact, if you were actually looking at the phone, this face will react to your face. So again, let's uh, keep going on. Uh, let's go to hairstyle. So if you go to hairstyle, again, you can pick colors. You can change the tone of those colors as you please. So let's see, uh, let's pick a red color here, like that. And then if I scroll down, I have all these options of different hairstyles uh, for that face. And then when you're done with that, you can go to the head shape and you can uh, pick a new, uh, you can go by age. So you want, you may want somebody that is very young, middle or a little bit older. And then from here, you can pick the chin type. As you can see, you have all these options. Uh, things reflect in real time. And um, so once you do that, you can go to the eyes. And again, with the eyes, you can pick different colors. Again, I like the fact that every time you pick it, it changes the color of the actual eye. Now, no matter how stupid the whole emoji thing is, it's still pretty cool that you can do this. So you can change the eye shape, eye, eye size, and all that good stuff. You can make modifications of the eyelashes, so I can pick different kinds of eyelashes if I wanted to. Uh, I can make a brow, uh, whatever brow that I want over here from all these options. And again, the whole point of this is to try to make it look like yourself. Uh, the nose, you can change the nose type also. Uh, you can change the lip colors if you wanted to, as you can see, okay, and tone it down again if you want to, or uh, make it bolder. And then you can go to the ears, you can pick small ears, large ears, you can even add earrings if you want to, okay. You can change the color of those earrings, and you can go to the facial hair, add some kind of facial hair, and as you can see, now we have something really weird looking over here, but that's fine. I'm just trying to demonstrate to you guys. Uh, you can add frames and you can add lenses to your eyes. So you can have sunglasses, clear glasses, whatever. So let's go like that. Uh, let's make it all red for some reason. Tap this guy. Now you have that weird shape. And then if you go to the headwear, you can also add some kind of um, uh, caps or whatever that you want. And again, you have all these various options that will fit anybody's style. All right. Now when we click done, it's going to save the emoji right over here, and you can start to use this as you use other emojis. So if I tap on emoji now, uh, it'll show up right there. This was the one I created before. 
This is the one I made now. So you can have as, as many of these as you want. And also you can modify existing Memojis. Again, I'm forgetting these are called Memojis. So if you tap this guy, you can edit this. You can go right back into that drawing board. Uh, you can also uh, uh, duplicate it and then modify it. Or you can just remove it if you do not like it. Okay, but that is the new feature uh, and emoji and memoji on iOS 12 for your iPhone 10 for you guys to enjoy. This is just a quick video to give you that update. Uh, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech and give this video a thumbs up. And also follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook at Saki Tech Online for the latest updates. Guys, have a fantastic day and drop comments down below and let me know how much you love an emoji.